Hello guys, Antoine here for Sim Architecture and welcome back to the channel and I'm finally here with a new video which is going to be quite quick actually because we're not building something huge, we're building a mausoleum um, inspired by a real place which is the Temple of Four Winds located in the park of Castle Howard in the UK. So this build is absolutely beautiful and inspired me a lot to build a mausoleum Actually, I just wanted to build something uh, small um, with a kind of abandoned look. So I decided to build a mausoleum because it's something I never did before. And I just like the idea of building a mausoleum. Um, and probably some of you don't know what a mausoleum is, so probably it would be a good start. Um, a mausoleum is actually, let's say, an enhanced version of a tomb of, or of a grave. Um, you can consider the pyramid as a um, mausoleum. Um, the Taj Mahal is a mausoleum. There was one of the seven wonders of the antique world, which was um, the Alicarnas mausoleum, which was also a great tomb. Um, most of the time, those big can be seen in uh, really prestigious gra graveyards, for example in Paris, in the so-called Père Lachaise graveyard. And as you already guessed, um, only wealthy and powerful people could afford such huge tomb. And yes, here it is. So. First, when I started this, I had in mind not building a mausoleum, but a just like a pavilion lost in a park where no one goes, like it's overground, the nature just came back to the place, but then I went for the idea of the mausoleum, which I think was a pretty fun idea. Well, a grave is not something fun, but building it was really enjoyable. I went for a really um, dark style with grayish colors, and then I added some details on the walls, like cracks, um, some trees and plants that are growing on the f floor and on the walls, just to make it look like no one has been there for years and years. This is really this abandoned look that I was looking for. And in the end, it turned out pretty good, I have to say, um, even if landscaping was really long and at first when you're just starting to put some trees and plants it just doesn't look that good because you have really to put a lot of trees and plants to make it look like it's abandoned so it took me quite a long a lot of time and that's why i didn't record it the whole landscaping process because it was really long and most of the time I was just dating so i think it would have been a pity to watch so yeah i only recorded the build itself, the interior and a little part of the landscaping if I remember well. Um, also this build is located in Windenburg on a 64 by 64 lot. Um, I really love this special lot because it's overlooking the ocean. It's on top of a hill or a cliff kind of and it just has a dramatic look that was perfect for my mausoleum. So yes, um, and also I use many custom content items, mostly from Alexander and the Gym 07. Um, I will link them in the description down below if you want to download this content. Um, I will also put this mausoleum on the live, on the gallery, so if you have the custom content, it will appear as you can see it right now in the video. But I guess yes, if you don't have the um, custom content, most of the items will be missing, so I'm not sure it's really worth it downloading, downloading it if you don't have the custom content. Um, but yeah, it's small build and there isn't much gameplay to do here, it's just rather for um, decoration, if I can say. There's nothing to do there. Um, or maybe you're into doing histories in The Sims, so it could be a great place to do in history. 
a story, sorry, not an history. Um, anyway, maybe you're wondering why I wasn't here for days and almost weeks. Um, actually, something happened. I bought this Nintendo Switch, which was at the same time a very good and very bad ID. Very good because I'm enjoying it like crazy and bad because I'm spending my whole time playing Zelda Breath of the Wild which is probably the best game I've ever played and yeah I'm so addicted I didn't touch The Sims for more than two weeks and I didn't have time and power to do the edit of this video I just wanted to play Zelda so I think it was good to do such a break because um, when you're building every day sometimes you just don't have enough inspiration and now I feel like I'm all new to the game like I have a lot of IDs um, the next build is gonna be a big family yeah a big wealthy family mansion uh, which will be CC free so it's good for you guys because I know that a lot of my builds are using CC and all of you don't use it and for some of them which are not free cannot afford them so the next build is gonna be CC free um yes I think I told you pretty much everything it was actually a really quick build um, which I really enjoyed doing I hope you will like it there are a few screenshots in the end so yes if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you next time bye